What's going on you guys? This is your boy Eagle Slayer 95 back at you with another video back with the juice once again. So um you know the history with um our Philadelphia Eagles running backs and uh the lack of, you know, of utilizing these backs to their strengths. Um you know, um the lack of running the ball like um, five times the past two weeks is just mind boggling and just completely unacceptable. Uh, you know, I would, um, and it's a shame because Miles Sanders does not deserve this. This is clearly a Howie and Jeffrey Lurie move, you know, because we got a puppet of a head coach, you know, who just kisses their ass and just, you know, does what they're, he does what they tell him. And, you know, that's all that has to be said right there. And, um, you know, I feel terrible for miles because he's like a hell of a running back and like, he could do so much in this offense if he's implemented correctly, which, you know, it's a shame because we have like this such pass happy, um, you know, front office, um, and it's a sin and it's a shame and man once we let this guy go um sanders you know he's gonna like i already know this once we let him go man he's gonna go off wherever he's at and i hope this does not happen you know i hope we figure this out sooner than later um because like i said this miles sanders <laughs> I'm oh, sorry that my dog is whoa, whoa, whoa. hearing car noises, you know. Whoa. A lot of this noisy neighborhood. Whoa. And, um, you know, that's, uh, whoa. it is what whoa. it is, man. Um, you know, Kenny Gainwell, he's a great, um, gem, you know, that was uh, probably our perhaps maybe one of our best draft picks of the previous year, other than Devontae Smith. Um, but yeah, um, they, they have to, they have to involve Miles in the game plan, period. You know, no ifs, ands, or buts about it. This guy, like I said before, I'll say it again, this guy would be wonders in his offense. You know, he has all the intangibles and tools you know, he just, you know, I think he's worked on um, hitting the holes faster and not just like dancing around and juking around um, the defender, you know, just running straight through them. And, you know, that's what this kid can do. And, yeah, hopefully we like, uh, you know, bump, buckle up, Eagles fans. This is going to be a bumpy ride. And um, I don't think it's not, I hate to break it to you all, it's not going to get any better. I'm sure you all do this by now, but, you know. But other than that, this is your boy Eagle Slayer 95 signing out. And I uh, hope you all um, have a great day. And uh, keep your heads up. Eagles Nation will get through this. You know, better days are ahead. And, um, yeah, we're going to have all those three first-round draft picks from the Colts and Dolphins. And hopefully everything will come into fruition in the future. So, uh, yeah. Take care, y'all.